Hey, this is Blake from the Gig Harbor Fly Shop, and today we're gonna be tying up this micro zonker, and this is a great little fly for, not only for trout, I think it usually mostly gets used for, uh, for freshwater trout, but this is a really good sea run cutthroat fly for Puget Sound beaches as well. And so uh, we'll, we'll dive into this thing in just a second, but we'll go over the material list. So we're gonna be tying on an A-Rex NS110 uh, straight eye streamer hook in a size 10. Uh, you can also tie, tie this on a Daiichi 2546 size 8. Uh, there's a lot of different uh, straight eye uh, hooks out there, um, but saltwater hooks, that's uh, good stuff. We're going to be using a, um, a squirrel strip. My package has been uh, almost gone. So squirrel strip, we're going to be tying that in brown. You could use natural as well. Uh, we're going to have a little bit of crystal flash for uh, just underneath the tail. For the body, we're gonna do a tight dub of UV ice dub in UV gray. And, uh, and then we just have, there's a little bit of flash on the side and there's, we're gonna use this, uh, this kind of fuchsia, um, not really sure what color this is. I think it's fuchsia, fuchsia or cerise, I bet it's fuchsia. Holographic flashaboo and doesn't take much, uh, but that's it. And then uh, for, we'll put some sticker eyes on there, 330 second sticker eyes and with a little bit of UB uh, float and, um, or thin to finish it off. So let's go, uh, let's go buy it step by step. Okay, I'm gonna start by tying in the crystal flash. And I got two pieces that I'm just gonna tie in here and fold over. Cut fairly short. Okay, now I have my squirrel strip and um, I'm gonna tie that in in the back. Those wraps are gonna be just over the same spot where I tied in that crystal flash. Then I'm going to I'm going to take my ice stub and I'm going to put just a little bit on the thread to start it. And then I'm going to double up the ice stub. This particular pattern has a has a pretty tight, uh, pretty tight dubbed body to it. But usually when I tie this fly, I actually I like the I like that body to actually be really buggy, and so I'll, I'll I dub it in pretty loose, uh, usually in a dubbing loop, and then I'll brush it out. Got to go back up on top of it a little bit just to kind of build the head up. Okay, now I'm going to tie in my holographic flash. And if the, uh, the flash has different if it's got like a crinkle to it or something like that, I want to get the part that's just straight. So I might cut it back a little bit just to, to get to that part.
I'm going to start with just a little bit of UV flow. 330 second eyes, sticker eyes. Okay, hey, there it is, the micro zonker, and uh, you can tie this in a bunch of different colors. I really like that barred effect that that squirrel uh, squirrel hide has, um, and um, and so black is a good one for freshwater trout. Olive is a great one for uh, out in the sound. So is this brown or the natural. Uh, if you need the materials, we have uh, materials in the description below with links. Make sure you subscribe to our videos to get updated with all the other tying videos we have uh, coming out. And I uh, hope you're having fun tying flies and catching fish on the flies that you're tying. We'll see you next time.